Yo, what's good YouTube? I am back with another reaction video. And we I know a lot of people have been requesting me to do this video. We got the Larry Bird 1981 Eastern Conference Finals Game 7 versus the Sixers at 23-11-5-5-2. So, uh, yeah, let's get straight into this video, man. I know a lot of people have been requesting me to do this, so we're about to get straight into it. Let's get it, man. Welcome to Bedlam in Boston Garden. Standing ovation as the Celtics are about to be introduced. They have come from behind in dramatic fashion in the last two games to force this deciding game. And keep in mind, only three teams in the history of the league have come from a 3-1 deficit to win. Irving, Caldwell, Jones, Dawkins, Hollins will be watching to see how he reacts to the headaches he's had. And Mo Cheeks, or Cheeks' headaches, we should say. Hollins in the backcourt with him. And for the Boston Celtics, we'll be checking Tiny Archibald's ankle. They tell us he's all right. He teams with Parrish, Bird, and Maxwell up front, and Chris Ford in the backcourt. 62 and 20 in the regular season. Three and three in games against each other is Irving, our MVP from game number six, and Chris Ford. This is from the corner. Larry Bird, the rebound. That's what Boston has done to Philadelphia. His confidence came back, and the Sixers knew that Tiny would be a factor. Cheeks driving baseline, blocked by Bird, and is picked off by Boston. Maxwell, Larry Bird with a block shot. Tiny all the road for the moment. Boston, relentless on the offensive board. Quarter. Like two fighters sparring with each other in this first period, Kevin. They just fill one another out. Hollins dishes it off to Caldwell Jones. Kirby. Perhaps a little extra past each other right now. They know each other's moves. They know everything the other can do. As Irving ties the feet, Dawkins, and it goes out of bounds. A hero in Philadelphia, number retired. Larry Bird misses a layup. Sixers still control. Four on three. Hollins pulls up. Bird coming back. Harris doing to Dawkins what he did to him. But this is but Larry Bird, another offensive rebound. And the seventh lead change the Celtics are up once more. Great offensive rebound by Larry Brown. He goes around the front of the basket. This is a great shot. It makes it look easy. That's a tough shot. Celtics stay with their starting five. 4-10 remaining in the first quarter. Larry Bird. Oh, I know. <laughs> Maxwell, Rick Roby, the substitute for Boston, into Larry Bird. Short baseline jumper. Ford gets it to Bird. Overplaying was Bobby Jones. Bird fires it up. Murphy a lead. Tony out to Hollins. They swing it around and look for Caldwell Jones. Triple teaming Jones, leaving Mix open. Mix in the lane. Short. That limited his effectiveness. ML Carr in low to Bird. Bird. I think the great players are really going to put their imprint on this one. Irving on the switch. Bird hesitated and missed. And someone will move on to play Houston in the finals. Bird blocked. Philadelphia, Tony. The only problem with him is that he points in the first quarter. He has 12 in the game. Three minutes exactly remaining in the first half. We have had eight lead changes in two times. In this seventh game, a triple team of Dawkins. Five seconds on the clock, and Bird picks it up. Here's Ford at the other end, and Chris Ford. And he'll count that as goaltending. He'll take that outside shot if you give it to him. Caldwell Jones. Ball goes to Boston. Caldwell Jones lost the battle with Larry Bird. Seven. The dock out to meet Bird. Henderson shooting over Cheeks. It's another one. Bird coming around to pick in the crowd. Puts it up and a foul. And Larry Bird on the line right now with 10 points. He, but in the final moments, he has hit the key shots. Well, what Bill Fitch did also, Dr. J. Caldwell Jones with 12, the high scorer for Philadelphia. Maxwell and Bird each have 12 for the Celtics. Caldwell Jones, Julius Irving, Donald Dawkins, Mo Cheeks, Lionel Hollins, the five for Philadelphia. And Hollins trying to get it in, bounced it off the back of Dawkins. No time for the break, however, but we'll watch that the next time. Tiny to Ford, Larry Bird, three-point play. If anything can ignite a crowd and ignite a team, a three-point play by their best player, it's the safest way to do it. Virtually even in rebound scoring and assists as Larry Bird goes up. 
Ford, three-point attempt is short. And Cheeks comes down with it. Sixers running, Irving on the left. Here's the dock against Bird. Bird made a tremendous block. What a defensive play by Larry Bird, just as Irving did it on the other end earlier. Sensational play by Bird. Two great superstars going at each other on the other end of the floor. Maxwell inside, gets the bucket. Dawkins triple team, short. Celtics can cut it to three. They do, and look at that touch. Irving finds Hollins. Lionel Hollins is short. 4.08 to go. Bird open, it's off. Up. All game. Help. Ford feeds Bird. Yes. Foul on Irving. Cunningham and Irving have had their difficulty in this game right here. And one of the foul. Ford, a check that Bird misses it. Roby, McHale, Carr. So most of the starters out of there. Larry Bird's in. Under a minute to play in the third. Roby, high. Knicks will give him the shot. They're not afraid of Roby shooting outside, but they are afraid Larry Bird will get hot. We don't have that anymore, so he gave it to Philadelphia. Seven seconds, you look at the clock, Tony trying to get the last shot, feeds it to Bobby Jones, one second to go, and that'll do it for the third quarter. And we have an altercation, Bobby Jones, and now both benches start to come over to the corner of the Boston Celtics bench. Bobby Jones is in a sea of white jerseys over there, Kevin. Those are the matchups. Bobby hitting outside, and no good, Bird the rebound. The Celtics have the lead, having run off six points to none for Philadelphia here in the fourth quarter. Cheeks and Tony. Tony is blocked out of the play by ML Carr. Good defense denying him the ball. Loose ball. Bird trying to get it away. He does to McHale. What a play by Bird. Carr inside. Bats it out to Bird. Bird can't do it. Six-point lead, four and a half to go. Will Celtic Pride win out, or will Philadelphia's determination to get another shot at that elusive title win out? We'll find. We'll find out soon. Irving, intercepted by Bird. That's greatness. Tiny Archibald. Watch out for Caldwell Jones. Four minutes and ten seconds to go. Fourth quarter, and the Sixers are up 89-85. Bobby Jones feeding inside, and it's picked off. Archibald will slow it up with four Philly defenders down court. Henderson seeing a lot of action in a crucial time. Bird, Parrish, Parrish with a big bucket, and it's a two-point ball game. And Boston will try to tie it under three minutes to play. Larry Bird going to the basket. As he goes in with 251. Is it great? Yo, he tried to. Yeah, he talking about what? Jumping, not jumping, what? He tried to murder. Try to tie it under three minutes to play. Larry Bird going to the basket. Foul. He's fouled as he goes in with 251. It's a great foul shooter, though. Great basketball over the years. 224 remaining. Boston has scored six straight points. One second on the clock. He got it off in time. Boston, third, saves it. Celtics can take the lead under two minutes to play. Tie score. Max three, Max three. three ties in the fourth quarter and three lead changes. Irving setting up for something. Fakes low into Dawkins. Double team. Dawkins goes in, misses. Here comes Bird out of the pack. 105 to go. Larry Bird pulls up. The Celtics lead. It's the outside shot. You have to hit the outside shot under these conditions. Philly keeps trying to go in deep. They're turning the ball over. Bird comes down the floor. Right here. Pulls up. Not an easy shot. Banks it off the side for a basket. That's
the difference. His outside shooting. Could be win or lose right here. One second to go. Philly can win or lose, barring a foul. Bobby Jones will throw the ball in from right in front of our table as Daryl Garrettson moves the security people away. Larry Bird will defend. Here it is. It's over. The Boston Celtics have won it. And they go crazy at Boston Garden. And Larry Bird is right in the middle. He's the eye of the hurricane. No one is the Boston Celtics who spotted the Philadelphia 76ers three games to one. And the Sixers, due to the Philadelphia club, or the Celtics due to Philly, what they did in 68, Kevin, you got to give them credit for taking it game at a time, one at a time, and they managed to beat on an excellent club, Philadelphia. Tremendous emotion, a great series with great players. You couldn't possibly ask more from basketball. Now Houston's waiting for Boston. That also will be a great series. Wow. Okay, now I see exactly why a lot of y'all is requesting me to do this game seven, man. Yo, I thought they was done for it. I'll be honest, man. That's crazy, man. GG's, yo. Oh, that's crazy. Like, yo, that was a crazy game. Anyway, yo, I'm, yo. <laughs> yeah, I see exactly why y'all was, a lot of y'all was requesting me to do that game seven and sixes. Yo, shout out to y'all, man. I deeply appreciate y'all so much. Deeply appreciate y'all. I'm just, I don't want to take up too much time, man. I'm on to the next video. Subscribe if you're new. Hit that like button. Turn on that bell, man. I'm uploading every single day. And, uh, yeah, if y'all got some more videos you want me to do, we finally did this game seven. And it was, excuse my language, damn sure worth it, man. But, oh, man, that was crazy, bro. I thought they was done for it. But, yeah, man, I'm out. On to the next video. Y'all got some videos you want me to do? Leave them down in the comments. Leave them down on my uh just, <laughs> I said leave them down my email. Send them to my email at thatfullyboy9gmail.com. And for now, man, I love y'all. I'm out on to the next video. Peace.